Yes, this is the secret map I've been secretly mapping. Look at look at that. I'm a, I'm a secret mapper now. I'm a, I'm a spy. Yo guys, what's up? It's with Needle Pro here, and today we are back with another video. And by the way, I got a new microphone. Okay, I I I, I, I did get a lot of uh, a new microphone yesterday, but then like I tested it and it's worse than the one I had before. So now I'm back to the first one, but I like I adjusted the, the audio settings and now it works better, hopefully, I, I I don't know, I'm not that sure. But today I'm going to show you a new secret project I've been working on and I'm actually also somewhat quite done, okay? It's like 80% done, it could be public in, in, in today or tomorrow and it's going to be a really amazing project and now, I, and now I'm going to sh show you what's about. Basically if we add ourselves a tag, as you can see we're going to have these two little player uh, balls, one is a blue and the other is red, and as you can see, going and hovering on an item can make me turn right or turn left. The objective of the game is to don't make the, the balls to touch the white, okay? Or it's gonna, you know, the white is gonna get painted, as you can see. And it's a really amazing game. I, 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 and you may say, Nico, did you get this original idea yourself? No, this idea wasn't done by me, but basically this was a game, a mobile game, available on the Android and probably even on, uh, on Apple Store, I, I'm not that sure, but I'm gonna give the download in the description. And by the way, this is a really cute mobile game, it's really amazing, and it really has a really good story, and I tried to recreate it with, you know, these little area effect clouds, and you know, it, it went pretty well, and I'm trying to recreate the entire game, I'm going to show you some clips of the game now, but I'm going to recreate nothing entire game, just some of the game, inside Minecraft, so you guys can just, you know, uh, play it out, and then you can play the game. It's a free game, naturally if you want you can buy custom levels, but, uh, you know, uh, even even the map is gonna be free of course, and I'm gonna also add a map level editor, so you will be able to create your own levels. Now you may say, but, well Nico, this map is quite boring now, there, there is only this stuff, well I'm going to add more stuff, like, an example, this block that moves, look at that, the blocks move, now it's even harder. And also here there is decreased visibility because the black is going on white. This is a really cool mini game. I want the map to be like 10 to 15 minutes long, so it's not gonna be that long. And also it tells a really nice story when you start it. So as you can see an example, a change is normal. And then, and then, and then it says, uh, do not deny it. So it, it, it's a really cool storytelling. Naturally I copied everything from the actual game and developers, but you know, this is actually Minecraft, so hopefully no one will sue me. Please, please don't sue me. But yeah, I'm gonna try to upload this map on Realms. I don't know if they're gonna want it because you know it's kind it's kind of weird. But now I'm going to show you the commands and how I actually created that little circle. So first of all, this map is gonna be single player only. So this means that only the player with the tag will be able to play the map. And basically, how this work, it, how this works is that the little balls are just two armor stands, okay? And when I do turn right or turn left, they're just rotating around themselves. You may say, Nico, how did you do the, the rotation? Well, in a really simple way I'm going to show you right now so these are the commands for the rotation sorry for the lag and also for the construction noises okay there are like some workers doing a building okay just behind my building and I, I must say the truth, I thought they would stop because you know it's, it's lunch time but no they didn't stop they are keeping on working they are really hard working and they are disturbing my videos <laughs> but, but, but yeah yeah I'm, ju I'm just kidding anyways these are the commands for the moving system and by the way what this does is that detecting on a uh, score of you know the the, the armor stand. Okay, I'm gonna show you in a really simple way. An example, uh, as you can see, those are the two armor stands. This armor stand has a score of 13, and this one has a score of 4. When we hold this item, the scores will go up or down if we hold this one. And basically, depending on the score, it's gonna TP the armor stands to another armor stand that is invisible. And, and those armor stands uh, make a circle. It was really hard to place them in a circle, must say the truth. But when you do tag, at, uh, when we add our tag, as you can see, when we do this, the scoreboard is gonna go up, and when we do this, the scoreboard is gonna go down, and then it's gonna make a full circle. Okay, this is quite useless. These are just the settings to add the scoreboards and night vision, so this, this is nothing. Then these are the items. Uh, so basically what this says is if you are in tag P and also your selected slot is this one then it's gonna score both players remove from the armor stance this one so you know it's gonna go down and the same thing for 5 so for this item but it's gonna go up then basically yeah this actually sets the item into, into your hotbar oh my gosh so much construction noises I'm sorry guys and all of this stuff instead just removes any single item you may have in other slots so you're gonna bug the map 
Yeah, no more Howard of Code backing with this technique. <laughs> and now the last uh, command block that's here, basically what it's gonna do is gonna uh, execute a spot P and it's gonna TP everyone to the spot P. By the way, the spot P is the middle of the circle, so you're gonna go with the circle uh, when it moves. And you may say, what controls the movement? Well, this does, well, this is a wall hitting detector, but also controls the movement, as you can see, around TP, RS, as you can see, it's TPing the, all of the circle a little bit forward. Then what else, what else is gonna do? If you if it detects that's nearby a wall, so if the block at at its coordinates is a wall, then it's gonna basically set block the the wall to the color of the ball that hit it, and the same thing. And basically then it's gonna TP everything back until the checkpoint. So that is how it works. Pretty simple. There is also some custom music in this world that you can check out, but and it's actually some free music. But I'm gonna sh I'm not gonna show you to it to you yet also i hope you enjoyed the resource pack that i created it, it took me a while to do i know it's pretty basic but it was still really hard and yeah i i cannot wait to show you more of this map guys once i complete it probably gonna be available for patreons in like two days and then i'm gonna make it public in like a week or so so you, you, you guys are all gonna be happy yes this is the secret map i've been secretly mapping look at look at that i'm a, I'm a secret mapper now I'm a, I'm a spy anyways dude i hope you really enjoyed this video about this map and i hope you will like the gameplay because i'm not i didn't show you the game play but it's really hard okay like the normal game but I completed the, the mobile game because I'm a try hard and I know I, I actually want the full version I want to pay for it anyways dude I hope you really enjoyed this video leave a like if you did and subscribe if you're new and also hit the bell and, the, and become a patron so I can get money and also join my discord and one last thing uh, actually what's the what's the uh, yeah, I mean check my check out my maps I guess yeah and also check out the mobile game that is in the description because it's a really amazing game and I suggest you all to try it out anyways dude this was it for today's video I hope you really enjoyed it and I'm gonna see you guys in the next one of Mapping with Nico, I guess.